What's going on? How you feeling? How you feeling? How you living? You know me. <laughs> Just chilling, staring at the ceiling like a villain, right? Okay. It's your boy JD to bring the video. Um Sorry if, if my energy is not there, it's because I'm just not waking up. I worked last night. I didn't sleep that well, nor did I sleep that long because I wanted to get back on my regular sleep, sleeping cycle, schedule, whatever. Um, and yeah, let's get right into it. So look what I got. I got some, I think this is shrimp alfredo with long noodles instead of the little pasta things. I just said pasta, but yeah. And some salmon. Salmon. What? I don't know how y'all pronounce it. You know, the last time I, I, I tried to pronounce it, apparently I was saying it wrong. But anyway, let's go and get into this thumbnail. Hold on. Okay, good enough. Because it kept sliding. All right. So how was y'all week? How was y'all day? What y'all do today? You know, I ain't do much last week. I'm probably going to do much this week. Mm. I'll put some um, hot sauce on it. Mm. It's tasty. I can tell I can't eat a lot of it. I can tell it's probably gonna hurt my stomach. But it's really good. Mm. What is that? Sorry y'all for much talking much. I am starving. Ugh. I I I normally make like a little dunk dunkin sauce for the salmon. It's just, well, apparently, the sauce that I make, they call it yum yum sauce. Never had it. But it's ranch, mustard, and ketchup. And it's pretty banging. Mm. Man, when I tell y'all, right, I am hungry. I'm hungry. I was trying to clean my nails. Um, I don't know how I got dirt up under them. Probably from my scalp. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I always say I can tell I'm not going to eat all this But I think I can tell I really ain't going to eat all this I'm trying to stuff at least the salmon down So I can have some Protein A good combo with this would most definitely be um, garlic bread. Yeah, I hear my mom. I wonder, are we going to get an interruption by it? Um, um, go I mean, mama. Hey, enjoy the side conversations. Jeez, it why is she talking so loud? Now it's distracting me. But hey, it's all good. I am my mama. Mm.
it's a, I blame it on the countryside of her. Like, she can go from a normal tone to, But then again, I can't judge too much because I do the same thing. Only when I laugh. Yeah. Only when I laugh. Look, I jokingly told my mom, but uh, I was like really serious. I said, because like every time when I try to sleep, I'm always getting interrupted by someone downstairs yelling or whatever. And I'm like, okay, when you go to sleep, I'm gonna start yelling and kicking and screaming at one or two o'clock in the morning. But when I told her that, she, she was like, don't make me kick you out. I was like, oh no, well, I don't want that. Okay. I'm trying to save money. I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to spend it. And I'm like, okay, good point. Mm. Mm. So, Listen to this. You know how much of an introvert I am, which I can see it being a setback and also a good thing. Let's talk about the setback. So I was just invited out to go out for two drinks. And it was with people that I know, you know what I'm saying? Well, I feel really comfortable with, well, I know them, but you know, feel more comfortable with. And what was I gonna say? Oh, geez, sorry. I'm having some psychosis from um, hearing all those alarms going off um, at work. It's just like, it just. But they invited me to go out to this Mexican spot for drinks and food and whatnot. And, you know, in my head, I was like, eh, I really don't want to go because, like I said, I'm just not waking up. I'm groggy. I don't feel like going. And then, you know, um, I asked who all going. And, you know, when someone says who are going, if you said the wrong person, they ain't going, right? So, he had told me, him and this group of people that he hang out with, is going. You know, I respectfully decline. You know, I'm like, no, nah, I'm okay, I'm good. And then, I don't know. I still felt kind of pressured a little bit because I didn't want to go. Talking about you just need, you know, you need to get the house. Stop being in the house. But I'm like, I'm fine with being in the house. Like, I'm honestly fine. I mean, the days that I want to get out, you know, everybody busy. So, um, and then. I did observe the people that they was hanging around with. They are cool people. Don't get me wrong. They are cool people. But they're not like my type of crowd. You know what I'm saying? That's their type of crowd. You know, and and like their friend like like their friends really do truly represent or is like an image of who they are. Which, I mean, they all are great people, you know? I just know them for years. So I feel more comfortable. Me, I can't just go out and up and do it. Like, my social, like, like just thinking about it made my uh, anxiety go up to, like, a 10. Well, to an 8. To an 8. And now I feel bad because I really don't want to go because I know how I am. If I would have went, to be honest with you, if I would have went... I still would have had a great time regardless, but I would not be engaging in that conversation. Like, I ain't trying to make third time the charm of them saying the same thing, like, you need to be engaged in the conversation. And then I'm irritable, tired. I ain't trying to do none of that. At least not tonight. 
No. But, of course, I thank them for inviting me out because it's very thoughtful. But I just can't. Like, if it was just with the people that I know, I won't mind. But I'm just not, I'm not ready yet to open up my heart to somebody that I, well, a group of people that I really don't know or I'm really not trying to converse with, not trying to, I'm not trying to do all that, you know? Like I said, no disrespect to them at all. Because like I said, I think there are some dope people. But one at a time for me. Introduce one person at a time for me. I just, I just can't. You know, I don't know the attitudes. I'm, I, I don't care to. Like, I have, I, I, I have my own personal issues and problems I need to work out before I try to meet anybody else. And and that's the truth. Like, I probably pass up on a lot of good people in life, but I know that I myself was not mentally ready to tackle on somebody else's emotions. And I don't have my own self in check. So I'm like, it's not fair to them. So. Hmm. Mm. Mm. I mean, when I say I won't finish this, I'm like, I'm flush. I think. I think it's because. Mm. I'm not having chest pains. I just, I think I'm thinking about that I was trying to be around a bunch of people. Ugh. And just thinking about the future it gave me real bad anxiety. I'm not gonna lie to you. Ooh. Okay, let me stop. Cause I feel like I gotta look. <laughs> okay. Alright, I gotta go. Cause I need to I need to put on a video so I can relax and calm down and stuff. So alright, peace and many blessings to you. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. I know there's not the full outro, but this is real life. Oh my gosh. Okay, bye y'all.